Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Afterbirth Showcase, or Afterbirth Plus Showcase, uh, for mods. I'm fucking this, this whole intro's. It's done! Cut it, cut it, cut it. We're done. We're retiring. The channel's over. We're shutting it down. I'm talking to my imaginary production team that doesn't exist. Anyway, welcome back to this. I know I said there was going to be more stuff. I know I said there was going to be a lot more stuff, but frankly, the plate is pretty full right now. So we're going to end this mod showcase on this video, and I'm going to go back... And I'm going to look through the rest of the videos and just see how much I was able to cover because I, I feel like we got a lot of content through these couple of videos. But what I want to do, with this is going to be a really short video. This is probably going to be like two or three minutes. Uh, and so prepare for that. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to be using another mod with in, in conjunction with the Devil's Harvest mod just to showcase to you guys not just how many floors and how many new areas and bosses and stuff were added into this mod so far. But I'm going to be using the mod... Oh, fuck, I don't remember the name of it. Hold on. Click it. Click it. It's the mod showcase mod, right? That's what it's called? Shit. All modded items in the starting room. The, the link will be in the description. You guys can go down there and get it yourself. But this is basically a mod designed to showcase items. It's basically designed to show items that are added in new mods so that... Rather than playing as Isaac and running around and re-rolling through all this stuff, you can kind of just go in and look at it. I'm so happy this is a thing because for the next couple of mod showcases I do, I'd like to use this mod to show you guys the new items, regardless of if we know what they do or not. I just want to show them off. And so we're going to jump into a new run as Isaac, and it's going to teleport us to a room filled with a shit ton of items. These are not even all... This is, I mean, this is... All of just the collectibles in Devil's Harvest. These are just the collectibles. Not counting pickups and hearts and all that stuff. We got a, a mimic there with some brimstone. I don't think he can actually hurt us, can he? I would imagine he probably can, but... Oh yeah, he totally can. Awesome. Then he's gotta die. There's probably more than one mimic here. But this... <laughs> I should have expected that. These are the items... Many of which we've seen, many of which we haven't seen. I'm First of all, I'm noticing there's a white brimstone here. There's our doom sign we saw in the one challenge. Uh, there's a rainbow milk. There's a, I can only imagine, is Tammy's body. But we already had Tammy's body. What am I talking about? We got Guppy's eyeball there. I just picked up a key. Okay. There's There's like 16 milks. So I was on par, I guess there would be 12, I was a little off, there's actually 16, and there's actually 17, because it looks like this is probably a milk. Hemp milk, shot speed way down, tears way down, or shot speed way down, tears way down. Or shot speed way up, tears way up, way down. I can't speak, I can't speak. Oh, I accidentally picked up the golem's orb. This, this goddamn mimic! Take the brimstone! Light barrage! I didn't want to take that! God damn it! use it! It's a, it's a holy brimstone! And I can't tell when it's charged. It's a holy brimstone. We've been waiting years. There's a golden greed dude. There's our there's our minions. There's a Gmail icon. Interesting. There's underwear with a heart on it. That looks like actually that looks like MLG Major League Gaming. A Major League Gaming logo. There's a balloon. There's a cannon with Bumbo in it. There's this freaking golden heart, which I'm gonna assume is an angel item. That looks like the pact right above us. We were familiar with this item above us, which was uh, from one of the challenge or from the character that was from Baphomet. Another what looks to be holy item above us there, Cricket's paw or Tammy's paw, one of the two I would imagine. Uh, I do know that they added a new cat. Oh, there's Guppy's body, the rock. So some of these we've seen, but there's a lot of them we haven't seen. Like this heart, I'm sure is something interesting. <gasps> oh my God, that's Max's head. That's totally freaking Max's head from Vanilla. Oh. My. God. And that's Broski. Bumski. He told me there was going to be a, uh, a reference to him in this. But look at all the milks. Let's just, let's just showcase the milks real quick. Because the milks are one of the things that I was most excited about. So we got one milk, two milk, three milk. We got four milk, five milk, six milk. 
Seven milk. Eight milk, counting the one that I took. So eight milks. Nine milk. Uh, empty milk. Ten milk. You imagined all stats up. That's amazing. Ten milk. Eleven milk. Twelve milk. Thirteen milk. Fourteen milk. Fifteen milk. Sixteen milk. Seventeen milk. So there's eighteen milks. Eighteen milks. Eighteen milks. All from those milk machines. I want to play with all at frozen food. Damage slightly up, you feel a bit slippery. So it's probably like ice physics, but your damage went up a little bit? Okay. Like, I want to touch all of this, but I just wanted to show you guys that this is, this is just a collection of what's in the game right now. And granted, as I've stated in the past, in the videos, and when we were talking about it, this is all balanced from, in my perspective, balanced properly. Some other YouTubers and streamers disagree with me. This is balanced properly, because there are some garbage items in this. There are some utter trash items in this, and that's good. For a game like Isaac, when you get Afterbirth and Afterbirth Plus that completely ruin the balance of the game and make everything so powerful that it's impossible to lose sometimes, it's good to have a mod like this that comes out and it's like, fuck your balance, let's, let's balance things again. Let's have items like empty milk. Let's have an all an imaginary all stats up show up in your item room. Because why? That's fucking hilarious. That is beyond funny. You can get a little salty, sure, but still, it's still good to have that. Because if you walk into every item room and get freaking Godhead and Tech X, you're going to be pretty uh, cool. And yes, I know that Godhead can't appear in a guy in an item room. For every bad item, for every little bum friend, there's a holy barrage light brimstone. For every Tech X, there's going to be an empty glass of milk. And that is what Isaac is about. So thank you guys so much for watching this care this uh, mod showcase of Devil's Harvest. It's been fun. It's been a great few episodes. I'm so happy that I was able to spread the word as much as I was on this. Even though the rumors going around are that it was kind of a joke and it's meant to be trolly. I don't give a shit. Team Probirth, hats off to you guys. I may be the only one, but you did a fucking awesome job on this. And I cannot wait to see the other 130 items you're going to add to the game to fill up another room this size. Thank you so much everybody for watching this and let's move on to another mod showcase catch you guys later